Hi guys, my name is Jordan. I'm a freelance filmmaker and video editor. And a couple of you have asked me to do a video on keyboard shortcuts. So today, here's what we're gonna do. In order of what I think are my most used, here are 20 keyboard shortcuts to help you edit faster in Premiere Pro. And just a side note before we get into this, I'm using a PC, so anytime we use the control key, substitute it for command on your Mac. Here we go. Number one, hitting the V button brings up your standard selection cursor. Number two, the C button brings up your blade tool so you can cut your clip. Number three, hold shift while using the blade tool to cut the entire timeline, top to bottom. Number four and five, copy and paste. Control V and Control P work in Premiere pretty much the same way as in any other application. From clips to effects, copy and paste are an absolute essential. Number six, plus and minus. Hitting either the plus or minus buttons will increase or decrease the size of your timeline accordingly, making it easier to get a full view of your project or to dive in for fine edits. Number seven, Control S saves your project. Please do it a lot. It'll save you at some point, guaranteed. Number eight, hit Y to use the slip tool. This keeps your clip exactly where it is on the timeline, but lets you slip forwards and backwards in time for just that clip. Number nine, when going through your clip in your source monitor, hit the period button to insert your selection into your timeline, starting where the playhead is located. Number 10, hit A to select everything to the right. Number 11, hit shift and then A to select everything to the left. Number 12, holding alt while dragging your clip will create an exact copy of that clip and then leave the original where it was. Number 13, hit the G key while a clip is selected to bring up the audio gain menu. Number 14, enter renders out your entire work area. Number 15, hold the shift button while pressing up or down to skip forwards or backwards between clips on your timeline. Number 16, both in your source monitor and in your timeline, hitting the L key will play your materials and hitting it again will play it at double speed and then again will make it go even faster and then again will make it go even faster and then again. Number 17, hitting J does exactly the opposite. Hitting multiple times will either decrease the speed or play your clips backwards. Number 18, Command T creates a new title. Number 19, the F key is your frame match. This will bring up in your source monitor the exact frame that your playhead is on. And finally, number 20, Control, Alt, and K will bring up the keyboard shortcut menu so that you can look through all the shortcuts and even customize them for what works for you. And that's it. Those are the 20 shortcuts that I find myself using most often in Premiere. But there's a ton of others that are incredibly useful. So I'd highly encourage you to look through the entire list of keyboard shortcuts. If you guys found this video useful, then feel free to give a like or even consider subscribing. If you didn't like it, then write me a comment and let me know what I could have done differently. But that's it for now. Thanks so much for dropping by and I hope to see you next time.